It's coffee with Hillary. Morning, which is to speak sad, and after, which is the um, last balcony in a Renaissance home, the sad people would often stand on the balconies and shout their ideas onto the masses, which was such a, a bad time for all these people that they just said, oh, let's kill ourselves and forget about all this tragedy. We, we really don't want to be part of this this uh, day. And we want to become um, evil night people, and that's how vampires were made, and um, that's the same thing as the morning after. Um, it's a strange one, I'll admit, but, um, you know, Merriam-Webster is never wrong. Oh my gosh, I don't know what to say. He's in the shower right now. So we have a couple minutes just to talk. Um, I don't know what happened last night. It was just like a blur, a terrible blur. Um, you know, sometimes you just, you just make mistakes in your life, I guess, and, you know, wake up and you have to deal with the circumstances the morning after, as they say. You know, the morning after is... <clears throat> is it a time where you have to recollect and just kind of get all of your eggs in a basket? Oh, I hope I have all my eggs in a basket. That may reminds me, I need to make some scrambled eggs. No, no, I can't be friendly to this guy. I have to get him out. Mm. When you have this kind of experience, it's important to, um, you know, call your friends. And Hello? Hi. Hi, Vicky, how are you? Oh. You don't want to talk? Let's try Selena. Hey girl. Oh, oh, who's that with you? Oh, sounds fun, sounds frisky. Oh. Selena just told me to invite him for coffee. I don't know. I'm gonna hope that he leaves. He sure is using a lot of hot water. Okay, this is how it went down. Me and my best gals, Vicky and Selena, we're discussing the hot tea. Ow, 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 ow. And we're trying to decide what we're gonna do that night. Selena said, I wanna get with the menses. But Vicky said, Boo, you whore. We need to make money. And I said, I could do with a cheeseburger, really. So off we went. We were standing in line and the bouncer was like, you can't come in. I need to see your ID. And Selena was like, okay, how about these? Ay, 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 ay. And the bouncer was like, oh, okay, go ahead. So we went to the bar and Vicky was like, vodka on the rocks, but with actual rocks. And I can crush you beneath my bones. And that's when I saw him. The handsomest, sexiest, grooviest, most impressive, calisthenically pleasing, most approachable, extremely watching his weight and eating probably only ice water sandwiches. Man of my dreams. I approached him and introduced myself to my new lover named Chad. I said, what's your name, Chad? He said, Roberto Estevez III. I said, I don't know what that means. I'm just going to call you Chad. He said, do you like dancing? I said, Yes, he said. Do you like merengue? I said, especially on coconut cream. He said, do you want to come back to my place and play Zumba Wee Fitness? It pretty much has all of these things. So we went back to my place because I wanted to show him another kind of dancing. And we danced and we pranced and we lost 500 calories each. It was a great your, shape, your Shape Fitness Evolve 2013 session. And then we passed that onto the bed to a text from Vicky about a cheeseburger. And that's how it went. He's gone. Oh, 
Sweet Jemima. Speaking of people who are still in my house, what the heck are you doing here? Get the heck out! Aww. Oh, what's this on Instagram? Oh, the new coffee with Hillary. Let's see how it is. Hillary!